individuals with the goal of premeditated murder traveled from Jacksonville to Tampa to commit a heinous crime in our city. I said at that time that we would make arrests and get justice in this case for all the victims, including the mother of Charles Jones, who traveled from Jacksonville this morning to be present for this announcement. Today, I stand before Tampa Police Major Pat Mesmer, Jacksonville Sheriff T.K. Waters, and Hillsborough State Attorney Susie Lopez to announce the arrest of three people in the deadly shooting of Charles Jones, also known by his stage name of Julio Fulio. In addition, we have warrants and are actively searching for two other individuals in this case. Today's announcement would not be possible without the outstanding investigative work of our homicide detectives and with the assistance of the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office and the ATF. These individuals took extreme measures to try to cover their actions, but they were no match for our investigators. Isaiah Chance, Elisa Andrews, Sean Gaithright, Davion Murphy, and Richard Murphy are all accused of playing a role in Jones's death and are all charged with one count of murder in the first degree premeditated with the discharge of a firearm and one count of conspiracy of murder in the first degree premeditated with the discharge of a firearm. Chance, Andrews, and Gaithright were arrested over the weekend in Jacksonville. Davion Murphy and Richard Murphy are still fugitives of justice and we are working closely with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office and the U.S. Marshals to apprehend them. On June 23rd, Tampa police officers responded to a shooting on McKinley Drive and located four victims. One person later identified as Charles Jones was pronounced deceased. Jones was in town celebrating his birthday and posted on his social media his locations several times throughout that night. Surveillance video was critical in this investigation as suspects were seen on video following Jones from location to location. This shows the links that these individuals were willing to go through and achieve that this murder would occur. At 4.15 in the morning, Jones began to head to a hotel on McKinley. One of the suspect vehicles is seen following the victim. However, instead of following them into a parking lot, they stage across the street. At 4.38, three shooters exit a vehicle and walked in the direction of the hotel. They murdered Jones with a handgun and two rifles. This barrage of gunfire also struck three additional victims who miraculously survived this incident. Let's look at this video. This is at the hotel, and you can see the shooters are getting in position for their planned out murder. And they are shooting at Charles now. And you can see that he's the passenger in that car that's moving and trying to flee. And again, they're still shooting at him. He's the right front passenger in that vehicle. Yo, 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 what it do, people? It's your boy, Mike Easy, man. And y'all just seen the police give a statement, man. The people co-inspired two gangs, ATK and 1200, co-inspired to kill Julio Fulio, man. They tragically followed him from his Instagram and his social media posts all the way from Jacksonville, Florida, down to Tampa Bay, man. Watched him actually spun around him a few times. Julio Fulio was sitting in the car and didn't even know that the car that was passing him a few times was ultimately going to take his life, man. But five people co-inspired, at least five people, that they have warrants out for to conspire to kill Julio Fulio. Three of them's been arrested. Two of them still on the run. 
The two Murphy brothers is still out on the run, but one shooter, Sean Gathright, was caught in the uh, body cam footage that y'all just seen. You know, and even got a girl involved, Alicia Andrews, even got herself involved. And it's tragic, man, that not only did Fulio, Julio Fulio lose his life, you know, celebrating his birthday, but five other people basically lost their life, too, because they just threw it away to the system. You heard it from the police, man. They're going to prosecute these people to the maximum. They're probably going to give these people 100 years because this is premeditated. They thought about it. They thought it out, developed a plan said hey we're gonna take this ride we're gonna take this couple hour ride because it's important enough we care about killing julio fulio so much that we're gonna risk our lives to kill him so you know i hate to say it man but they get what they deserve you know um you know julio fulio's mama maybe this will bring her some closure she'll never be able to get a little boy back but maybe she'll sleep easier and not knowing that these people that actually killed her son is going to be um, in prison now because they are going to get convicted. They have enough, like they said, from the license plate reader, cell phone data, to know that these people were involved in killing Julio Fulio, man. And it's crazy to me that these people can um, do all this stuff behind a game, something that's just three letters, something I understand that's your homeboys. You've been down with them for years and years. But at the same time, but at the same time, man, he's saying, okay, scenario. You want to be down with ATK or 1200? You got to prove yourself. You got to prove your loyalty. Okay, but if you go prove yourself, you go prove your loyalty, they're going to be wanting you to do it over and over and over again. Just say you is getting some compensation for doing that. It's going to come a time where you say, I don't want to do this no more. I want to have a family. I want to go put down on the house. How are you going to be doing that when you out sliding, when you out riding for the game? And some of these people weren't even that young. Some of these people was 27, 30 years old. They grown men. You got grown men out here sliding for this stuff. And you're not even getting compensated like that. What, you getting a chain? You can't go put that chain down on the house. You know what I'm saying? It's just stupid to me. You know? Um... Uh, it's just sad and unfortunate, man, that these people throw their life away for that stuff, man. And even if you was Young and Ace's friend, Young and Ace makes his living off of really making diss songs, you know. And Julio Fulio dead now. Um, his his greatest rival's dead now. Just like Yellow Beezy and Mo3. You really ain't heard nothing of Yellow Beezy since Mo3 died. Whether he's scared, if he had anything to do with it, I don't know that, but... It's just, you can't make your gains and that stuff stupid, man, because you threw your life away. Now you caught in a cell. And I ain't never going to be able to get out. I'm never going to be able to see your family unless they come visit you now. That's just a lose-lose for everybody. That's why I feel like them gains are stupid. You know, it all held down from Chicago. Yeah, there's been game wars and all that stuff before then, but Chicago drill music really put killing people, dissing your ops, and putting it in music videos and making money off of it. And it just trickled down to Florida, you know? They just a really product in the environment, and they chose to, to go that path in life, you know? And it just is what it is, man. But the police said they, ATK and 1200 co-inspired to go down there and kill Fulio Fulio. They're gonna prosecute him to the max because it's premeditated. They thought about this. They thought about this and dwelled on it. They had plenty of times in that three-hour drive to say, hey, come on, man. Why are we doing this? Let's not do this. Let's go back home. But they didn't. So they're going to get punished to the max. Best believe it, man. But I just had to make this video to let y'all know what's going on. Two of the murder suspects, two of the shooters, actually, are still out there on the loose. They got warrants out for their arrest. Three of them's already been um, arrested, including one of the shooters. So... You know, we'll be back to update y'all when those other two arrests happen. And best believe they're coming because these people is not playing. They're showing up 50 deep with tanks and everything to arrest these dudes. You know what I'm saying? So I'm pretty sure we'll be back real soon with some more updates on the situation, man. But this is Mike Easy. You know we keep it real, man. Easy keep it real, raw and real, straight to you. Hit that like button, drop a comment. Let me know what you think about this video. 
go in this video 50 likes man y'all go ahead and run that up for your boy um you know we couldn't correct with it man straight like that and until the next video you already know man peace